of you know it being through a bit of an injury now we have decided that the best course of action is to go to surgery there's a little bone causing me so much pain and now we're going to the surgery and we're going to trust the process but it's difficult right now definitely hit the lowest moments of my recovery so far i can't really do much at the moment compared to what i was doing last week rehab i was told was going to be a bit up and down and i'm definitely in a down moment at the moment francis who has been helping me psychologically even if you're not injured just working with these people i want to work with them beyond this injury feeling very grateful for them but also a little bit down about how things are currently moving in my rehab right now I've been training like this since I was 12 years old. Why can my body not do that anymore? I think I struggle with that concept. Francis and Harvey have um, been helping me through this. I was able to do a very reduced version of a ballet bar today, which I did. And so doing it with a soft knee is really um, good to learn the control so that if I need to control my hyperextension, I can, whereas I never had the strength to do that before. So it's actually a good thing. Just go on point soon and do jumps and I can't even stand in fifth position. I felt further away from ballet than I ever had been. Um, my ankle was fixed, but now I couldn't straighten my knee or turn out. Um, but with Frances's help, she guided me through on how to manage my injury where I could still be training in ballet without making it worse but it was definitely a daily pain where I just had to monitor how much I could do and some days I could do ballet and some days I could do nothing so behind the smiles inside I was struggling more than I'd ever struggled before I was considering maybe I was never going to get back to ballet to keep me going over Christmas I taught some zoom classes with you all which was amazing and such a privilege I was able to start getting back to some sort of ballet in the centre. I think this was maybe my first day doing proper centre work in what must have been almost three, four months. Uh, I was still in a little bit of pain with my knee, which would be worse on some days more than others. But again, I had a lot of support from Francis helping me through. Only ever think of dying when I'm staying. Francis really guided me through this time where I really didn't understand what was going on with my body. It was adjusting back to doing ballet, but I didn't understand the process of what that's like. It's not just the injury side that's going to be affected, it's your entire body because your body works all together as one. So once I understood that, I understood the necessary need for recovery in this crucial time. I was learning how to manage my workload a lot better and prioritizing the training that I wanted to do. Instead of doing as much as I possibly could every day, I just focused on the things that I felt were most important for me getting back to my company work. The end of every session together would be to improvise to one of my favorite songs on point and just let it happen naturally because my biggest thing on point was just the fear. There was such a sense of fear of injuring myself again or injuring the other ankle and I was really struggling to overcome that. So by dancing in this way where you're not overthinking anything, you're just allowing your body to breathe and work within, within its limitations was an amazing way that Francis got me to start feeling more confident again on point because I had really lost a lot of confidence. Um, I even got to do a session with her in person at Danceworks where she helped me through the mental blocks I was having with some movements that used to be very, very painful during my time of injury. Pirouettes was actually the thing that caused my injury. 
So getting to do that for the first time was such a victory and she really guided me through it. And this next moment I'm about to show you is one of my favourite moments in this whole rehab process. The absolute joy of nailing my first pirouette back from surgery on that ankle, which three months ago couldn't even point. We also did my first ever jumps back from surgery. I know they look a little bit poor, but again, it was a big victory to do something that used to hurt and now it doesn't. Yes. So these are the people I keep talking about on Zoom. Um, they have been helping me so much through my rehab process. I'm sure I've talked loads about them in this vlog, but I'm so grateful for you guys. Thank no, we're you grateful so much. for you being around. And I will, Amazing. I've linked all their stuff down below, so definitely check them out because these are incredible human beings. Oh, that's very kind. So, here I am, almost a year and three months since I had my surgery. About a year and a couple of months since I met Francis and I can only thank her for everything that she has done for me. She completely transformed my life with her work. She helped me rehab not just physically but also emotionally from lots of things that I struggled with that probably caused my injury. She has made it possible for me to go back to doing what I love because at one point I, I was wondering whether I would ever be able to dance again and live my dream of being a professional dancer. Um, so I cannot speak enough of how valuable Frances' work is, actually how invaluable it is, like you can't even put a, a price on it. It's changed my life, um, it's made me a healthier, stronger, dancer but also a healthier and stronger person. I now approach my training in a much more level-headed mindset. I now am much more long-term focused than short-term focused which is providing a healthier framework for the goals I want to achieve in my life. I honestly don't know if I would still be dancing if it wasn't for Francis and Bodylistics. I, I owe so much to Francis and I'm so grateful. Um, so this is a story about how a girl who just loved to dance was able to get back to doing her passion because of one very, very special lady.